Well, we're back in North Beach, and we're in the mood for what else? Crab. Well, we are here at a place called Betty Lou's Diner. The owner is from Hawaii. I believe it's Kauai. I'll double check, but I think it's Kauai. Uh, anyway, they do a, a walked crab that is out of this world. We've had it a couple of times already, and we really like it. They chop it up with ginger and garlic, and they saute it in a big wok, and you get all these little pieces of crab with all the ginger garlic flavor. It's delicious. We're going to get that. We're going to have ourselves a nice crab dinner in San Francisco. How can you go wrong? So the dish of the day is called Mike's Wok Crab. That's what we're going to share here. And I am also going to start out with some clam chowder. And Young could start with clam chowder or oysters or some kind of a cocktail. It's up to her. They have West Coast oysters, East Coast oysters. Oh, actually, their Chardonnay is Ferrari Carano. That's a good Chardonnay. I really like that. Yeah. And, of course, the wonderful San Francisco sourdough bread. You never go wrong with that. Starters? Um, I'm thinking about maybe a, a cup of clam chowder. Yeah. Nah, how can I pass up the crab here? It's so good. Yeah. And uh, we have also oysters, West Coast oysters. Uh, I saw that. Okay. Okay. So if you want oysters, you could do a happy hour oyster prank. Yeah. And I, I had a question. I remember that the owner here is from Hawaii. Is she from Kauai? I know. Actually, she's not here. Oh, okay. Okay. If you'd find out, I just want to know because, yeah. Yeah. I like Ferrari Carano Chardonnay. It's very inexpensive and it's a good Chardonnay for the price. Mm -hmm. Very nice. Delicious. Ferrari Carano is crisp, it's fruity, but it's also buttery. It's a nice Chardonnay. Okay. My clam chowder. By the way, I checked and it turns out the owner is in fact from Kauai. I thought she was from there. Um, but it's been a while since we've eaten here and so I thought I'd double check. Let's try the clam chowder. Mm. Good, rich, clammy, not overly creamy, not overly thick. It's a nice chowder. It's very, very pleasant. It does have that taste of fresh clams in it which makes it that much better. Want to taste? Yeah, thank you. Now the East Coast would be on your right, Miss. This one here is the East. This one the West. White stuff, very spicy horseradish. Red stuff, cocktail sauce. Ah, okay, thank you. <laughs> really good, right? Mm. It's not overly thick. It doesn't have a ton of potatoes in it. It's got a nice clam flavor to it. It's a real strong clam flavor. It's really good. Yeah, lots of clams in there. Mm-hmm. Mm. Potatoes so soft. Mm. Here. I ordered two different oysters. You did? Mm-hmm. You ordered one from the East Coast and one from the West Coast. So here's the New York oyster and the San Francisco oyster. Oh. Yeah, I'm better than you are, so don't you try to talk to me. I have this. Actually, I'm going to mix it with this. Just, yeah, just mix it all in. Yeah. Have a complete horseradish mm -hmm. cocktail sauce. Okay. Yeah. Very good. Yeah. Delicious. So let me taste this. New York style. First of all, I'm Oysters. You think it's seafood, but it's not. Yeah. Very good. It's um, not so meaty. Uh huh. Uh, it's temperatures, of course, the temperature is perfect. Mm -hmm. And it's not so sweet. Mm -hmm. It's really good. Maybe you know what? I should eat. Just what I taste is just uh, this. Maybe this one. 
the sea is without cocktail sauce. Okay. It was, it was just like the hot air the whole time, so it was like all of the, so it was like the This one is more like the ocean. It has a more bitter taste than, than the other one. I think I like the New York one better. It was really hot. Yeah, in San Francisco, but I like the New York one is better. Now I'm going to get this cocktail sauce. Mmm, it's good. I want some more. The New York <laughs> one. Go order some more. New York one is really good. Maybe I'm going to have a couple of more. They say the happy hour, um, instead of $2.50, they're going to say $2. Mm -hmm. Which one is the New York one? East Coast, right? East Coast is New York. No wonder. East Coast one is dollar more expensive. Yeah. Uh -oh. That's why it tastes better. Uh -oh. <laughs> <laughs> well, just... It's happy hour. You yeah. get 50 cents off. Yeah. You might as well go for it. I'm enjoying my happy hour clam chowder, though. That's not happy hour clam chowder. Mm -hmm. It is? It's clam chowder, and it makes me happy. Oh. So it's happy hour <laughs> clam chowder. <laughs> yeah. mm. Mm. This is really good clam chowder. You know, like a it. lot of clam chowder, even here in San Francisco, mm -hmm. they put too much flour. It's too thick. This is really this good. Is not too, yeah, this is really good. Yeah. It's not too thick. That's no. what I like about it. This is good. And it's got a strong clam clams. flavor, which is really nice. Lots of clams. It's very rare you get bad seafood in San Francisco. Mm -hmm. You know, most of the restaurants know that seafood is what they've got to do right, and they do it right. That might have been time-lapse photography. It was there, and then it was gone. <laughs> yeah, it feels like it. Now, what we're getting is the wok crab, and I'm not sure, but he may very well just get a crab and hit it with a wok. It's very <laughs> possible. But we don't know for sure. But it's good. And we're going to eat it. We're going to eat the whole wok crab. We had before, right? We have had it before. We've had it twice before. And both times we liked it. And so we're back for more. By the way, the sourdough, you know, I could just come up to San Francisco and eat nothing but sourdough bread the entire trip, and I'd be happy. But we also get great crab, great shrimp, great everything. Now, I never consider crab to be a chore because Young is my automatic crab shelling machine. You gotta clean it. I gotta clean it? They gave us bowls. Oh, yeah, ready to crack and roll. Okay. Okay, best way to eat. Mm. With your mouth. I don't have to crack it. Oh, maybe you don't, you don't, it. don't deprive me of my crab. Hanging down. It's yours. Tell me how you like it. Look at this. Look at this <laughs> giant piece of crab. This is my crab. Nobody can have this but me. I think it's very tasty crab. And the sourdough bread dipped in the sauce is even better. Mm, so sweet. It's really good. This is one of our favorite places in the city to get crab. I do notice that the shells are very loose and it's pretty easy to crack. 
I don't know. I'm very happy. I'm, I'm in a very crabby mood right now. <laughs> My name is Krabby Jack, and I'm eating Krabby Krab. I'm gonna have a crab hangover. <laughs> What's that? Mm -hmm. Three minutes and 27 seconds. <laughs> Look at this. I finished them all. There's no crab left. No crab left. No cra crab left anywhere in San Francisco. It's all gone. <laughs> Young ate it all. It's a crab catastrophe, I tell you. <laughs> and look at the, the one they found. Yeah, after all, because there was only one walked crab in there. She could have eaten two walked crabs, or three, was, or four. It was so good. It was really good. So what I'm going to do, the ginger in here. I'm not sure you can put the ginger we had delicious crab, delicious chowder, you had delicious oysters, and the wine was perfect with it. It's just overall a very satisfying San Francisco style dinner. Mm -hmm. Really nice. Mm -hmm. And I think I'm I'm ready. Well, because you keep pushing me away. I don't. Yeah. Okay. Now. <laughs> okay. Now, I think that we're generally ready for a great San Francisco style dessert. Now that we're done with our San Francisco style dinner. The first time we came here, we came here with young sisters from Korea. We were hosting them in San Francisco, and I said, you know what? You guys all love crab so much. We should go to Betty Lou's Diner. They're known for their walked crab. They cook it with ginger and garlic. And uh, I think your sisters will love it. So we brought them here. And everybody went crazy over the crab. They all just went absolutely nuts over it. The sisters loved it. They, to this day, talk about San Francisco yeah, and the crab and uh, the wonderful meals we had here. Every time we come to San Francisco, we do come here to Betty Lou's because we like their crabs so much. Uh, and we all also go to Scoma's because I like their crabs so much as well. And, uh, you know, we go to other places as well, but we never pass up this place.